darkness in the hearts of men and women all across the earth. I really see it in lots of places. Child labor. Everywhere around the world is just so prevalent. Widespread poverty. Being sold for sex. Corruption in the government. Abducted is just something that it's just you're not expecting. It wasn't a choice. It's never a choice to be put in that situation. How lucky I am to just be living in a spot where I'm not put in that position, where I'm not um, worried every day about having to sell my body for sex and um, just uh, especially like lose my virginity to, um, to just someone that I don't, I don't even know. Seeing it overseas um, was definitely a big thing, but then also just reading stories about uh, kids that come over to the United States when reading the paper about it. The girl just, she, she had no idea. She was promised by the man she fell in love with that she would have so many blessings coming to the United States and, um, and to come here and just um, just be, um, just brought into this world that you weren't expecting and to be seduced um, and not knowing what uh, what you're getting yourself into and just thinking that it's going to be better and it's not. It just it really helps to remind you that um, the promises of a better life um, are through Christ. I believe in the power of prayer, that only Jesus can make all the wrong things right. My weak little cry moves his heart. He hears. They don't want to be in their position so that we're not um, looking upon them as um, victims, but rather just um, brothers and sisters didn't want to be in their position or forced into it. It really just rips your heart out and just makes you just long for um, justice and just gives you a real passion for the kids and um, all the injustice. As we worship you through song, we remind ourselves that we must go. As we seek your face, we remind ourselves of a broken